Oh my god. So I've just finished watching the finale of The Bad Batch and it was incredible. If you haven't watched it already, please watch it for yourself. And I just thought, in honour of them, in honour of The Bad Batch, I would showcase you today five different mods for each of the members of Clone Force 99. There will be timestamps in this video if you want to skip to any of the parts that showcase individual characters that you want to see yourself. And of course, if you want to learn how to install these mods, click this video, link down in the description down below. All of these mods together were made by MankDemery09, a user on Nexus Mods. I will leave a link to that in the description down below. Check it out, there are so many amazing mods this guy has done. If you do actually end up enjoying this video, please leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel, that'd be much appreciated. Thank you very much and enjoy the video. So starting the showcase here, I'm going to start with Wrecker. So we go into the appearance. Obviously, he probably won't have any others. Yeah, they're all the same, so that is absolutely fine. The emotes are here, so we'll just listen to them. Why don't you pick on someone not your size? Now you're talking, yeah! Is it over already? Oh, man! Cavalry has arrived! So moving on next to my favourite character, who is Han Solo. Not Han Solo, it's Hunter. So, we now go into the appearances, I'm pretty sure, yeah, it just goes back to Han Solo, doesn't it? We'll go back, and we'll go into the emotes. Is that an order? I guess I'm disobeying that one too. That's not our style. We prefer going to them. Alright, men. Let's hunt some droids. We do what we do. So next up, we have Tech. As you can see, he doesn't have the yellow tinted goggles, which is a bit strange, but at the same time, he still looks very, very cool. The level of detail on these is just so nice. I love these skins so much. That is not ideal. That's fine, but if you fall, don't take me with you. All in all, I would say that could have gone much worse. So to be fair, that's probably the least best one. They're not bad. But the emotes aren't that great because of the quality. Again, they're pulled from the actual episodes themselves, so what can you do? Anyway, let's move on to the penultimate one. We have Echo here. So he looks pretty damn cool. I do like the look of him, and we'll go into his emotes right now. You had enough action for today. We'll handle this. I'm doing my best. You want to come out here and give it a try? I am not a liability. I'm the best chance we have. Well, there is a way, but you're not going to like it. So those are probably actually the best ones, the best quality ones out of all of these. But anyway, last but not least, we have Finn, aka Helmetless Crosshair, which I thought he was pretty cool throughout the show. The arc of this character is one of the best I've seen for a while. Unfortunately, I couldn't find a decent set of emotes for this guy or an audio overhaul, so unfortunately, he doesn't have any emotes. From me personally, you might be able to find them yourself, but what we're going to do now is go into a game, just showcase a couple of these. Uh, also, there is Commander Scorch as an added bonus. I thought I'd add him in, just replacing Captain Phasma. I can do a separate video on him because he is pretty cool. Looks very good. Also has his own name. Everything is new, as shown in my last video, which I'll leave a link to down below as well. If you want my opinion, sounds like a trap.
In and out, quickly and quietly. Accepting a transmission. Sorry, it took so long. 